Yo, what's going on guys? It is your boy, your main man, your main black man, Tavius. And welcome back to another video on Dragon Ball Fighters Season 3. So today, what we're doing here, as you guys can see on the screen here, we are currently in the dojo right now. The Fighters Dojo. I've been wanting to do this video for a while now. We're gonna go over here to Kefla, and she basically tells us all the Season 3 changes. Yet, Season 3 has been out for a week at this current point in time. But I still want to do it for you guys, for the people who haven't seen everything yet. So we're gonna just go through this and see what it's gonna show us. It may show us some stuff that, I, that, we, that we don't don't even know yet but anyways let's get into the video i will see you guys when we're inside the dojo okay it says press a button to start one new z assist changes in season three new z assists have been added type z assists are extremely powerful but they take longer to charge once used we're gonna call uh gohan oops i forgot where my buttons were for a second gohan android 16 and they take forever to read to regen these things take so much longer to regen than than, uh, than everything else. Jeez, that takes so much time. That is so much time. Two, advantage gauge. Changes in season three. The gauge above the timer compares each team's overall health. The team with more health will have their color take up more of the bar. The land and meteor smash. Level three. Let's get it. <laughs> so I wonder what else, what all they're gonna show here. Check the advantage gauge. <laughs> Call Leafla. Three, power to special moves used to consume one bar of key gauge. So basically EX moves, but now they only consume half a bar, making them easier to use. Land, flurry kick heavy. Stuff is half a bar now, which is actually crazy. Oh, you got to do them both at the same time. Okay. Gotcha. I don't know why you'd want to do that combo, but hey, do them. Oh, I got to do it two times. Bink. Okay. Four. Follow-ups after a vanish. Changes in season three. You can now follow up a vanish attack in a combo with a special move or super dash. See what the new combo routes you can come up with. Stand heavy into vanish, super dash, light, light, light. Yeah, you can go like super fast now. Where'd the impact go on that heavy? All right, five, Dragon Rush after a standing light attack. There's the tick throws. There's the tick throws, baby. We're, they're coming, they're coming. So basically just L in the, in the DR. That's actually so busted for this game. We do not need tick throws in this game. We definitely don't. As if Dragon Rush wasn't already hard to tech as it is or react to. Now we got tick throws, baby. <laughs> That's another layer. It's another layer. Number six, Dragon Rush in a combo. Changes in season three. Dragon Rushes are now easier to land in combos. So stand heavy, vanish. Hmm. So they made it easier to do? Yeah, this is actually... Okay, hold on. I think I, I timed it wrong. That's actually insane. You don't even have to move anymore. Before, like, something like that would have completely missed. Number seven, forward medium. So basically 6M. When performing a low mid air dash after a forward medium attack, when sparking blast is active, you will no longer jump over a crouching opponent. Pop spark. Hmm. I didn't even know that was actually a thing where you would, like... Actually, I did know. Yeah, now you don't you now you don't cross over the opponent if if they're crouching. Oh, here's the key charge power up. Changes in season three. Charging key now deflects your opponent's key blast. You are also less vulnerable after charging, making it more viable to use in matches. That's actually pretty crazy, but I, that's still not gonna make key charge useful at all. They try to, but you can do this now. You can cancel it, which is actually pretty crazy. I didn't even read that. <laughs> Well, basically, you can super dash out of, out of... Oh, God, it's a lot on the screen. 10. Z assist recovery time. Once your opponents drop their guard, Z assist won't start recovering until some time passes. I wish they would tell us exactly how much time it is until you're able to get your assist back or when your opponent's out of, out of block stun. But... Who knows? Maybe someone will find out eventually in some point. <laughs> what the freak? Is that a... Is, they're acting like that's a combo string. That That's unsafe as freak. Confirm that Z assist is is unavailable. Oh yeah, it's not there any. Oh, I gotta do it twice. I gotcha. Yep, still doesn't, still not there. Doesn't start regening for a while. If your opponent forces you to switch with Dragon Rush, your next character can appear faster if you don't press or hold any inputs. Oh, 
Oh, I go, don't hold anything. Just let him. Just let him tag me out. And then I do this. <laughs> Freaking Team Gohan, bro. If your opponent forces you to switch with a Dragon Rush, you can delay when your next character appears by holding back. Just let go of directional input to input to what? Oh, input to appear. It's a pretty long time. Got to let her do it again. And then when I come in, I do this. Attacks while jumping in the air will no longer hit opponents in a crouching guard. Oh, I'm not crouching. Gotcha. <laughs> Fuzzies are, are gone. Fuzzies are sniped. I like how they use Bardock because they know that's the best character to test it out with. Landing while in a mid-air guard state will now place you into a crouching guard state, making attacks while jumping into the air no longer connect. So get switched out via Dragon Rush. Hold to delay as long as possible. Mid-air guard. And then just hold the mid-air guard. Okay, gotcha. Mm, so holding back instantly puts you in a crouching state. If you if you block that. Interesting. 15. Limit breaking power. Oh god. The, the the infamous limit break. We already know how busted this mechanic is. If you're down to one character left, that character will have their attack power increased and get extra key gauge. Who's ready for an epic comeback? The comeback of all comebacks. The comeback that we all need to see. With limit break, Yamcha. Limit break, Yamcha. Wolf Fang, last hit, hit confirmed with sparking. <laughs> uh, solo TOD. Okay, so let Gohan die. I don't even notice a difference, really. <laughs> At least not with that move. You have completed all challenges for this character. To exit, select Return to Fighter's Dojo from the pause menu. All right, well, that's it. Very short and sweet. Short and sweet, but I've been recording for almost 15 minutes. So that is all the changes that they made with Season 3 in terms of mechanics. I hope you guys did enjoy it. Like I said before, I wanted to put this video out a long time ago, like a week ago or so. Like when this stuff was first coming out Wednesday that I'm posting this. So I hope you guys do enjoy the video. If you guys enjoyed the video and you guys want to see more, Make sure to click the top the top right corner to see what videos I have right there. Check out my previous videos before this. And if you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe. Make sure you click the bell. Subscribe to the channel so you get notifications. So you know whenever I post. Um, my boy's been um trying a little bit harder. We've been a lot more consistent. I'm changing up my thumbnail styles to make them look more appealing to the eye and make people want to click on them more. Also, if you haven't already, make sure to follow my social media, my Twitter right here and my Twitch. I stream all the time, Monday through Fridays, about 1 to 4, 30-ish PST, PM. Check your boy out. I'll probably be streaming when this video goes up. Who knows? On my Twitter is where you guys can contact me, and then I always put notifications about my Twitch streams. We're trying to make that blow up. So those are in the description. Check those out. Make sure you follow your boy there on both of those social medias. So should I get 10 likes on the vid? And like I said, subscribe, click the bell, like the video, leave a comment. Let me know what you think about season three and if you're enjoying it so far. I think it's super fun. Kefla is amazing. More Kefla videos to come. And that's pretty much it. It's been Tavius. Remember to always smile and have a great day. I love you guys and uh, yeah, guys. Peace. It's been a minute since I made an actual video video. Everything else has been street footage.